it's just a quick demo of this uh, auto hotkey script that uh, uh, lets you customize uh, what you might call workspaces, uh, opening different programs and, and arranging the windows just how you want it. Uh, for example, I've got one hotkey combination that will open up uh, Outlook uh, in an e in my inbox, and I can hit a auto. I can hit a, a hotkey to open it. This is this is the workspace. You can hit a hotkey to open it and adjust it to a certain part of the uh, position on the on the screen. So if it's not in position, then it will go back to position. If it's in position, it's in focus. I hit the same hotkey combination and it'll minimize it. Um, a, a different hotkey will bring up a uh, Firefox browser and minimize it. Uh, you can you can have it open uh, more than one uh, workspace at a time. So if I hit this other workspace combo uh, for editing auto hotkey scripts, uh, it, it opens these windows and it positions them just how you need them. Uh, to be able to navigate through the windows um, like you need them. You can also open uh, file folders, uh, like a certain file folders you, you go to frequently. Uh, I have those on my, on my other uh, monitor. Um, but, uh, but yeah, it's, it's a really cool um, thing that I use every day. It's, it's such a time saver. If you can learn those, uh, those hotkey combinations, um, then it, it, it can just really be a, a, a lifesaver because you just hit that to go. If I want to track my time, I hit this combination, same combination to minimize it, um, same same combination to uh, minimize multiple windows, um, and uh, so yeah, you can you can it's uh, so like uh, oh, for example the Firefox one. You can have it. Uh, um, set to automatically close if you hit that same combination key combination um, you can have some windows that you want to close when you hit the combination and some windows that you don't want to close you can have some windows uh, automatically open if you hit the key combo and, and others not um, for example in the um, hk studio space here uh, if I didn't want uh, the, the auto hotkey help thing to come on automatically, then I just uh, select auto open and hit enter, change it to zero. Um, you can change the, the uh, file paths here. You can have, you can even, and this is a really cool thing that, that Maestro did. You can have, uh, um, if you're on a, a laptop, you can adjust between one and two monitor setup. So one monitor setup, uh, it, it would be, it would go to this position and this size. If it two monitor setup, it would go to this position and this size. Um, really, really cool uh, deal there. You can also uh, open uh, the the. Uh, you can open it by right clicking the uh, window title. Um, you can do custom. Uh, you can edit uh, the path, select uh, select files by hitting enter, or you can double click and then manually adjust the the path there uh, for different things. Um, anyway, yeah, it's it's just a really cool uh, app. Um, uh, let's see. So, like, if you wanted to create a new workspace, you create it here. And uh, let's say I'll call this um, uh, screencast matic since that's what I'm using. All right, so then enter the name. And then, uh, so here it comes, shows up here. And then you can select, or you can add windows. So like uh, I've got that window open right now. Um, screencast o -matic, whereas I've got a lot of windows open, don't I? Um, there it is, right there at the top. So I can add that, and it will automatically add, uh, it finds the file path, which is really cool, uh, finds the file path, 
and then adds it to the exact coordinates that you want it to go to. So if I wanted to, uh, if I wanted to um, open up like right there at the bottom corner of my screen, I can just put it, place it there, and then on the monitor count, if I've got two monitors open, just hit the enter key, and it automatically adjusts to those uh, those coordinates. I want it to automatically open when I hit the hot hot key, so have that set to one. And I don't want it to automatically close, so there you go. Um, and you can edit the name uh, of, this is like the window title. So, um, wait, is that? Can you edit the name? I don't know if you can. Oh yeah, you can, yeah, enter. Yeah, um, and so if I just want to say screencast-o-matic, do that. If I want to add the uh, the hotkey, I select the the group uh, you know parent like item here, and then hit enter. And uh, say I want it to be uh, Control Shift Alt uh, nine. Okay, save hotkey. All right, Control Alt Shift Nine. All right, I don't know if it did. <laughs> uh, oh. yeah, yeah. There might be something goofy going on with the with that particular combination, but uh, but that yeah, that's that's an example of of um how you can do that, or or if you're uh uh. uh uh, advanced auto hotkey user um, you can use uh, you can use uh, you can just manually enter so if you like wanted uh, to use oh for example um, the Windows key and uh, shift and control Eight. Windows key, shift, control, eight. Um, then that should do it. Let's see, minimize. Yeah, there we go. So that's what it's doing because it's, it's recording. Anyway, um, yeah. So that and you can add multiple windows to a work a, a, a workspace group. Um, there's a little help file there. Yeah, so big props to uh, to Maestreth for uh, putting this together. Uh, it's it's really something that I use every single day. I love it. And I hope you find it useful too.